I was like, I was sitting there, I just got out of the hot tub, and I was like, man, I am burning up. And my face, you know what I mean, my head was hot. I was just like, should I shave it? And my wife was like, do it. <laughs> I was like, of course you would. And then uh, Lewis was with us, uh, and he was like, yeah, shave it, why not? And I was like, seriously, everybody's saying shave it? I was like, all right, we'll shave it. And so I shaved it, and I was like, man, I look like a little kid. I look like I'm 18 years old. You know, everybody's saying that I'm an old fart. You know, now look at me. You know, I have no gray in the beard. I look like I'm 18 to 21, and I feel like I'm, you know, in the mind, I'm about 24. Are you going to be shaving the top as well, like you usually do? Uh, thank you very much. And am I going to shave the Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to cut the hair at the top. Yeah, I just, uh, when I'm around my kids, they're not a big fan of me cutting my hair like that. So I try to keep it somewhat long for them, and then I'll shave it when I get back here. So by the time I get back to them, and they'll notice that it's shorter, but I'll grow, start growing it out for, for them. So we don't get to see you on UFC Embedded this time around. So what's it like been, you know, since you've been in Vegas so far, and how are you enjoying it? Uh, Vegas, uh, the whole atmosphere, uh, you know, like I said, it's it's pretty excited here. Uh, you know, the, the the fans and the way everything's going uh, is pretty awesome. It it is pretty hectic because there are three fights going on. But other than that, it's pretty, you know, being International Fight Week and everything and the UFC 200 card, you know, like I said, it's just a privilege. You know, you soak it in sometimes. You know, sometimes we, as fighters, we just, it's another card, it's another card, it's another card. And this time, you know, I, I haven't really done much because it's Vegas and it's 105 or it feels like 140 outside. But, uh, you know, I've been walking around doing some things. So, I, you know, I, I enjoy Vegas. Looking forward to that early early uh, weigh-in, right? Oh yeah, I can't wait. You know, by by 10 o'clock, I already have one meal down. By the time we come to the main weigh-ins, I'll already have my second meal down. You know what I mean? So uh, I think that's very important for us uh, to be able to rehydrate back. You know, with all the rules that have been going on and keeping us from being able to rehydrate back, I think this is going to be the best thing for us because you know that gives us realistically 10 hours. You got to think if I weigh in at 8 o'clock in the morning. I'm done by 8.30. All right, we don't step on the scale until 10, uh, 4.30 on the main stage, right? So that right there, then you got to do an hour. You know, it takes about an hour for all the media, or media and not only that, but also Dana White speech and all that kind of stuff. So it just, you know, by 6 o'clock, you're finally getting to your hotel room. So from eight to six, that's a lot of that's a lot of time to rehydrate, and also not only that, but like I said, when we come here, we'll be able to have food if you want to, or drinks. You know, you just can't walk up on the stage with them, but it's going to help us. It's definitely a 100% plus for us. So in that time window, you do plan on being there first. Right at 8 o'clock? Oh, yeah, yeah, I'll be there at first. Uh, because, like I said, uh, tomorrow I plan on only losing like three pounds tomorrow. <laughs> That's all I have to lose. So I'm pretty excited about that. Three pounds and nothing to do all day but lose weight. I might, uh, I'm, it's going to be very nice. And, like I said, I'll be able to go to bed at 71, wake up at 70, drink a little bit of water, go down there, weigh in, and then start my process over. Thanks, Johnny. Good to see you.